Hey guys, uh, I'm about to get on to my uh, the week ahead video. I'm going to go through all of our products and give you my technical science view. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to make a, a quick video. So in this video, I want to tell you why there's a big misunderstanding and a big um, there is a big misunderstanding about funded accounts out in the marketplace right now, and you're and you need to understand what it is. Being funded. Um, you can be funded if you've had a job before and you fund your own freaking brokerage account. You are funded. Uh, Y'all are kind of viewing like getting a funded account from any of these companies as like it's a diploma. It's not a diploma. Uh, I have three degrees and even after you get degrees you still got to go get a job. Um, it's not a diploma. <laughs> It's just you're work, grinding up your way to a paycheck, and that's kind of how you need to view it. Okay, they're not going to actually send you a paycheck. It's going to be a direct deposit, but treat it like a paycheck. You want to get to a funded account and then, like, look beyond that. Look beyond to, and now I want to make income. And so it's like, yeah, I'm a funded trader, Okay, well, what if you were a doctor or you work construction and you funded yourself in your own freaking Thinkorswim or TradeStation or Oanda account? Are you funded? It's kind of silly when you really put some thought to it. So this whole hype around, quote unquote, I am funded. He is not funded. She is not funded. She is funded. It's kind of uh, silly. It's not an intransitive. By the way, you can get in a funded account and fucking blow it. Duh. So, I don't know. Um, is it a good thing to be funded? Of course, it gives you an opportunity to make income uh, that otherwise you could not make. But you got to look at the long game, people. Like, I want to get funded, then I want to make a paycheck, and then I want them to put me into a live brokerage account, and then I want to make income. <laughs> And the journey doesn't end. It's a job. It's a career. It's, it's 5, 10, 20 years down the road. It's I want to, this is my job. This is what I want to do for my career. And whether I'm doing that in my own brokerage account or whether I'm doing that through a, through a funding company, the result, I mean, the, it's all the same, folks. It's, the goal is to make income, to pay off your bills and to live the life that you want to live generating income. So a lot of people out there are kind of treating like being funded as though it were like getting a diploma. And I think that that is, it's like a status symbol. It's very stupid. Uh, it's not a status symbol. It's um, kind of, I mean, you should feel good about it when you get funded, but they're going to make it easier and easier for you to quote unquote get funded. You're still going to be in sim. They're not going to put you to a live brokerage account if you're a clown. If you're a gambling degenerate, if you over leverage all the time, okay, if you have no idea what you're doing with day trading and if you over leverage consistently, no one's giving you their money to trade, okay? No one. If, if you put on 10 NASDAQ contracts in one spot on a tiny account that you only have $3,000 loss limit, who's giving you money to trade with? No one in their right mind is going to give you money to trade with if you're over leveraging all the time. Uh, sometimes you want to use a lot of leverage. Again, look at all the look at all the SEC and CFTC disclosures. Leverage can work against you. It can also work for you. Sometimes, when you're pyramiding into a position, you're going to have a lot of contracts on, and it's quote unquote a lot of risk. But the higher probability the trade, the the you know the tighter the stop loss, the more contracts you can put on. So the risk is a balancing act between leverage and and risk. What, what I'm trying to say. A lot of you are thinking like being funded is kind of like the new Cadillac. It's the new Escalade. It's the new Bentley. And it's not. It's now I have an opportunity in my yet still simulated account. They're all simulated. Until, you, until they put you in a live brokerage account on Tradevate or on whatever, you're in sim, buddy. You are in sim land. You're in the land of simulation. Okay. They're not putting you into a live prop account, into a live brokerage account, until you consistently show that you are not over leveraging. You're not going to blow all their capital. No one's giving you money if you are, if you are a, a raving gambling degenerate. 
sorry. And believe me, I've been there. Uh, it's taken an immense amount of control for me to take one contract at a time to pyramid into positions, to go from one contract to two contracts to three contracts. You know, it's taken a long time to learn that habit. I'm still not fully there yet myself. But my point being is that y'all are really thinking about, and YouTube and social media and Discord, everybody is treating being funded kind of silly. Um, your goal, your only goal, this is it, is to generate income. It is to generate alpha. It is to make money. That is it. Whether you're doing that through your own account or whether you're doing it through a prop account or whether you work at a hedge fund, there is one and one goal only. Make income. That's it. Okay? So, do I want to be funded? Yeah, absolutely. Would I like to be say to say I am funded? Yeah. I've been funded before and I over leveraged and I didn't use mis risk management and they shut me down. Of course they would shut me down. They're not going to give you their money to trade with if you're not responsible with it. Period. So, I mean, that's end of story. And if you're trading all these SIM accounts and you think they're real, they're not. Uh, even if you can make money on it, even if it is a funded account, if they're not putting you in live funded, if you are not in a real brokerage account, they haven't moved you to a real brokerage account, it's not real. It's a SIM. Okay? So this whole thing where like being funded is like getting a diploma, it's like getting your CDL license or something, it's not. Um, so I just kind of wanted to make a quick rant about that. Uh, Y'all are treating this wrong. You're treating this all wrong. You're missing the objective. The objective is to become a professional at what you're doing. Okay? That's it. It is to become a professional. And professional is not going to be done. You know, I didn't get my law degree in one day. I got it in three years. Okay? I didn't get my bachelor's degree in one day. I got it in four years. Okay? So... It's the same thing with trading. No one's given in their right mind is going to give you their money to trade with unless you've shown over a period of time that you are responsible with their money. Okay? And if you can't see it from the company's perspective, you're missing it. You're missing it, buddy. If I had $100,000, I, would I want to go fund a day trader that is going to gamble it all away? No. I wouldn't give myself $100,000 right now, to be honest with you. I don't think I'm responsible enough yet. I don't think I'm skilled enough yet, but I can get there. It is doable, but you have to change your mindset. It, being funded is not a diploma. It's not a diploma. They're kind of in, in some ways. I think the companies are kind of playing into that, and I think that Apex definitely plays into it. Top Step also gives you a certificate. My certificate would be put money in my bank account. That's it. My certificate would be until you put me in a live prop account, you don't really, you know, I'm not really there yet. Until I'm actually risking your capital, I'm not really there yet. That's it. Okay? Um, I'm going to be on very soon uh, with another upload on the, uh, on the week ahead. I'm going to go through these markets. I'm going to tell you from a monthly, weekly, and daily time frame what I think the bigger time frames are telling us. Uh, through a technical science uh, look, through inefficiencies, liquidity, technical science. We're going to have a look at these markets on a longer term basis, even though we're day trading. Um, my last thing is you got to, bro, to my brothers and sisters out there, Lord willing, you must change your mindset. You're not trying to get a, a funding diploma. You're trying to make an income. You're trying to make a career. You're trying to pay off your bills. You're trying to get out of debt. Whatever you're trying to do, you got to change the mindset. Okay, mindset's got to change from oh, I want to get this funding diploma so I can get that on there in social media and say I got a funding diploma to I got a paycheck, paycheck. That's it. Income. All right. That's all I got for you right now. Um, kind of want to let the runtime of this video go above 10 minutes because there's kind of YouTube algorithms for that. So I'm going to let the runtime of this video go over 10 minutes. I basically said my whole piece about what I want to say. Um, I have my top step refer friend in the link box below. I also have my trading view. I highly recommend trading view. Best looking charts in the industry, in my opinion. Uh, they, they, you know, you can get to regular trading hours on the bottom right. Um, so highly recommend trading view. You will notice trading view refer friend is my second link. Go pay for a pro account there. I get 15 bucks. You get 15 bucks. So it's worth using that refer friend link. 
Okay, runtime is over 10 minutes. I will talk to you all soon. Bye.